about the settlement calculation. How to calculate settlement or footing. Okay. Uh, with no, with the no, with the no of structures transmitting from foundation to the subsoil, the stress will increase. We call it stress increase. Okay? And the stress increase will cause the sediment, the deformation of the uh, ground of the subsoil. And what sediment in our chapter four? At page one hundred and thirteen seven, chapter four. Um, what sediment of fourteen? The segment of footing is defined as the vertical displacement, vertical displacement of footing or foundation. Okay. And uh, in this chapter, we will discuss the compressibility of combined snails of soil. Segment analysis and conversation theories, okay? Uh, have you remember when we introduced the, uh, the soil mechanics, we gave an example of the palette of fine art in Mexico. Uh, that the palette of fine art uh, museum building have a segment of 3.65 meters but the uh, segment is a uniform segment uh, maybe the ground settled uniform okay so the building, the museum building, it in continuous use, not destroy, can continuous use, okay, due to the uniform sentiment. Uh, even though it has sub 3.65 meters into the surrounding soil. Uh, but the door, the door of the uh, building uh, cannot open again. The door of the building below the ground due to the sediment. Okay, so we should go downstairs to the uh, door of the uh, building. Okay, but it uh, can uh, use even now. So uniform segment has some uh, influence to the structure, but. Uh, not cause the structure to destroy or collapse, okay? But for non uniform sediment or uneven sediment, then the structures will uh, tilt, tilt, or crack, okay? Uh, here, the two uh, building touching 
due to the uneven settlement. Maybe one building still to the right, and the another building tilts to the left. So it touches and uh, uh, destroy destroy the two buildings. Okay. So the uh, even settlement have uh, significant influence to the structures can cause structure to kill or crack. Okay. So how to uh, estimate the settlement and uh, how to decrease the settlement. Uh, maybe is the uh, uh, chapter four. Okay. Objective of the chapter four is to study the uh, settlement, the soil compressibility and the settlement calculation method. Okay. Here for engineering case of foundation transmit the node, the superstructure node and the uh, self weight to the uh, subsoil underlying source and uh, how to uh, calculate the settlement in this condition okay well discussed in the uh, uh, following lessons okay here uh, a question why
have no compressibility. Have no compressibility, okay? So the segment depends on the compressibility of soil there. Why foundation setup? Due to two factors. Actual load and the compressibility of soil melts. Okay. And there are two kinds of uh, sediment. Uniform sediment and non-uniform or differential sediment. Uh, we've discussed the uniform sediment uh, have no influence to the structure uh, safety, but maybe have some uh, effect on the use, on the use of the structure. But differential sediment have significant influence to the structure uh, safety. They cause the tilt or the crack. Okay. Uh, next question is about the soil compressibility. When the soil compress, compress or uh, have compression, the soil it uh, consists. The soil consists of three parts, the soil particle, okay? The soil particles and the uh, uh, water or gas. When the soil has compression, The soil particle compression or water compression or gas compression is what induce the compression of the soil. A soil particle compression. The soil particle. Yes. Oh, maybe the soil particle. Very hard, have a big rigidity. Okay, so if uh, if no, it applies to the source. Maybe the compression of soil particle is dictated uh, very small. We can omit it. Okay, and the water gas. Compression? Yes. Uh, when applied, uh, when those applies to the soil, maybe water and gas, it came from the void. Mm -hmm. Okay? <laughs> but water, gas cannot compression. So, maybe the soil compressibility is this part we call void. Void compression. <laughs> this uh, soil compressibility uh, characteristics uh, different from the materials such as the concrete or the steel, or the uh, uh, other uh, art, art, uh, man made material, okay? Uh, for the soil, the compressibility is dependent on the uh, reduction of value of void, okay? And the reduction of value 
of way needs some time. This process may be a long process due to the permeability uh, of the soil. Okay, if the soil is a permeable soil, now the that the sand or sand melts. If the compression process is gravity, but for clay, when the compression process is slow, will last several years or several months. But for sand, the process only uh, several meeting or several hours. So the uh, compression of soil divided with time we call consolidation. Okay? The consolidation it relates to the sediment dependent of time, okay? At first, we'll discuss how to describe the uh, store compressibility. Here, we should use the laboratory tax. Now the laboratory, the laboratory tax is conducted in the this equipment. Okay. Here we call the naturally confined compression tax. Naturally confined means maybe the soil sample can uh, in the natural, okay? Only 